All right, so this is looking look, looking promising. Uh, I've never seen it do this before. Basically, what I did is I reflashed the stock recovery image, and then I used the uh, firmware that, or the ROM or Android OS, whatever you want to call it, that originally came with it, which is 1.6. Uh, but before I did that, I actually did a fat. I formatted the SD card with a uh, FAT32, not a quick format, but a complete format. It took several minutes. Then I put the uh, uh, PKG file on the SD card, put the SD card inside the uh, streak, and then I went ahead and booted into recovery mode or whatever, and then uh, installed the PKG file from the SD card. Uh, it went through its process of loading. After it did that, then it rebooted and it got to the screen that you just saw a second ago. And right now it looks like it's going through a rebooting process now. So hopefully this will be good. Alright, so after it went ahead and it reinstalled the stock ROM, it said it was updating and doing the factory reset. Uh, now it's booted up to the O2 screen. It's been on the O2 screen for maybe about a minute. Uh, I'm going to leave it just alone for a while just to see if it boots up or if it ever gets past the screen. Alright, so here we go. I was able to recover Dell Streak before it was just given the uh, Dell, the Dell logo when you booted it up uh, but now it's functioning again uh, it's back on 1.6 uh, so I know that's not the most current one but at least it's uh, at least it's functioning again which uh, is definitely in the main thing. So.